When I'm making hamburgers at home, I like to do everything from scratch, from mixing to binding all the ingredients together in the food processor. And that means you can also do veggie burgers in your food processor. My vegetarian version is very popular and it's so easy to do. So using the same concept as mincing to start with, I've got a sharp blade in the food processor. So the cauliflower, about half a head of a small cauliflower goes in, along with some spices, some smoked paprika, and I use garam masala and a pinch of salt at this stage. And then I'm just going to blitz it until we get a crumb consistency. Now that the cauliflower is minced, we can add some other ingredients. You can't have a veggie burger without some lentils. So some lentils go in with some white beans. And these white beans not only taste good, but they really help bind all the ingredients together so our patties don't fall apart. Also, some other binding agents, a touch of chickpea flour. You could use plain flour if you like. So a few tablespoons in and two eggs. Crack our fresh eggs in. And now I'll let the food processor mix and bind all of my ingredients together. Okay, let's have a look. Wonderful. See this consistency? That's what we're looking for. So to form our patties, just with a cookie cutter here, we're going to place some of our mix into the cookie cutter. Press it down to make the perfect shape and we'll take that off. Now don't forget you can pre-make these, freeze them and next time you want to have a vegetarian inspired burger, this is the way to go.